Shalom, I want to give all praises to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakhah Kadash, and double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone, and Shalom to the brothers out there pushing this word in sincerity and truth. I'm going to jump right into this, these scriptures, and these are uh, scriptures about the name of the Lord and how important it is. Um, first scripture I'm going to jump into is Baruch chapter 2, verse 32. <clears throat> And they shall praise, and they shall praise me in the land of their captivity, and think upon my name. And who is they talking about? Mostly, all I know is talking about the elect first and foremost, because we're in the captivity of the Edomites, in A.K.A. Babylon, A.K.A. Sodom and Gomorrah, A.K.A. Egypt. And they shall praise me in the land of their captivity and think upon my name and the lord said pray without ceasing so we're always supposed to be constantly thinking about yahweh why yahweh Shai, the heavenly father and his son and that's you know that's righteous second scripture i'm gonna jump into <clears throat> straight to the point is ecclesiasticus chapter 17 verse 10 and that goes hand in hand with Baruch chapter 2, verse 32, talking about they to explain who they is. And the elect shall praise his holy name. Besides this, he gave them knowledge and the law of life for an heritage. So this is a way of living for the elect. Lord, whether I'm part of the elect, Lord, whether my elders are, Lord, whether the apostles are. And, 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 all, and for the brothers out there, Pushing his word and sincerity and truth on the four corners of, of the of the earth. You know? I'm gonna read it again. And and the elect shall praise his holy name, Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shai Bahashem Rakhar Kadash. Uh uh for everything. For everything. You stepping outside the door, using the bathroom, washing your hands before you eat, before you go to sleep. Cast thy burdens unto the Lord. You know, the Lord wants to hear hear the, the, the righteous uh, um, prayers. Um, I'm going to jump into Psalms 99 and 9. Psalms 99 and 9. Exalt the Lord our power. Exalt the Lord Yahweh our power. And worship at his holy hill. For the Lord our power is holy. So exalt the Lord Yahweh Bashim Shai our power, the only power, and worship at his holy hill. The hill is talking about the house of David. The the the, the righteous men that are being built up right before. You people's eyes. For the Lord, our power is holy, and holy meaning separate, uh, uh, set aside from the rest of this world. So the main point is exalt the Lord, bring uh, bring His name up all the time in holy conversation, point blank period. Uh, your mindset in, in is to be in these scriptures, be spiritual. Um, pray without ceasing, fast when you can, and be brotherly, you know, because we're one body trying to make it, make it out of here, out of this hell hole, out of, out of hell. This is hell, you know, uh, hell is the con uh, condition played out on earth. This is not our heaven. This is not our rest. We need the Heavenly Father, Yahweh. We need the, His Son, Yahweh Shai. Point blank, period. You know, Yahweh meaning He exists. Yahweh, Yahweh Shai meaning um, He He deliver or He saves. So if His name is, if His name, Yahweh Shai means He saves, we got to call on His name for us to be saved up out of here when, this, when the stuff really gets bad out here. Nothing has happened yet, you know? And... You know, I wanted to bring this scripture out in Proverbs. 
11 and 21. Though, though joined hand in hand, the wicked shall not be unpunished, but the seed of the righteous shall be delivered. So for all you sellouts and Uncle Toms that say, oh, you have a white friend or so, I don't even say that. Oh, I have a Edom, you have an Edomite friend or an a, 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 a Ishmaelite friend, basically a heathen period. You know, they're the wicked. They want to see you fall. They want to see you be on their level to have a heathenistic mindset, a worldly mindset, a carnal mindset. And, you know, the wicked, the wicked shall not be unpunished. So if you want to join hand in hand with, with the wicked, two thirds, the heathens, etc., you're going to be destroyed right along with them. And, and, and if you do know the name and you, 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 and you want these heathens to make it on, make it on a chariot, then you're not in the right mindset. You got to have a rulership mentality. You know, the Lord is a, is, is a man of war and we're in war right now, spiritual and physical. So that was straight to the point. I hope this video was edifying. Um, I'm going to give all praises. Kahala Yahweh, Bahashem Hamashiach Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rukwak Kadash, double honors to the Apostle Great Millstone, and Shalom to the brothers out there pushing this word in sincerity and truth on the four corners of the earth. Shalom.